Okay, so. Oh, Rain. Yeah. yeah rain, that one. Montorio is a player from MDBA who is in town, the national, visiting. Really? Yeah, he's Wait, so he's from MDBA. Oh. He's in town. He's in the state because he's in Asheville for work, and he came with us. All right, well, that's nice. Uh, I see. Yeah, I seem to remember that name. I, I couldn't really put my finger on it. Yeah, he's repping. But uh, Zeth Dragon's repping NC with these uh, with the throw combos. Doing a lot of damage. Yeah, I'm, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, if Corio wasn't completely overwhelmed by the matchup since with true. Oh. No, that's not gonna kill, but yeah, yeah, you make, it makes sense. I mean, I mean he's one of the better guys. Now he plays Bayonetta now, but you know, he will, he knows what to avoid. So. Yeah. And Bowser is just one of those characters. Isn't, isn't Mario Bowser like actually like not bad for Bowser? Because like I seem to remember like, because Mario's down throw is uh, uh, weight uh, dependent. Yeah. <laughs> So basically, that means uh, for anybody who doesn't know, uh, a, a throw. Sammy, move the mic closer to your mouth. It's harder to hear you. Uh, so, so when Mario does the down throw, it, because Bowser's a heavy character, it takes a while for him to like. Oh yeah, to come out of down yeah. throw lag. Okay. And then, oh, but, so like, it's harder to combo, and so you can't really down throw up air. Yeah, I was like, what is Firth talking about? I was like, oh okay, now I know what you mean. Because yeah. They have extra Captain Falcon has the same problem. Yeah. So that's what it means to be way dependent. I thought it meant it affected the knockback. Yeah, but that was um, a fantastic down tilt. Uh, getting. This is the best of three. Nope. The best of fives. Yeah, best of three. Well, they're wrong. They shouldn't have. <laughs> they're wrong. All right, so we're gonna so we're, uh, Zeb Dragon up one game. Cow Hunter, can you hear me? That grab was. <laughs> I, I am actually one of the taller people here, but because I am like down here, it looks like, yeah, you know what? I'm sure you're right. No, I'm kidding. You're like <laughs> six foot. You're like 18. All right, so next game. Uh, what is this? Smash Bros? Oh, it went yeah. to Ness. Corio uh, yeah. actually plays Ness, Pika Mario. Um, I guess he feels more comfortable in this matchup because Mario is very subject to get. He's a great character, but he's really subject to getting outrage. Like, just straight up outrage. Yeah. And as I said before, I, I guess um, when, when I when I said that I think Mario Bowser actually isn't that bad for Bowser, I I think the Switch is just kind of uh, proving that he believes that uh, Ness is better than Mario in the matchup. Now how much I don't know. I actually have never I haven't seen this matchup too often, so I, I wouldn't really know. But uh, yeah, we're gonna see how this works. So far, he's dealt more damage to Bowser than he did game one. Oh. Oh, 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 that's unfortunate. That, I, I don't know, I, I was thinking that may have been a, a down He might have tried to down tilt. Yeah. Um, or maybe, you know what, maybe he was mashing. Maybe. Oh. oh. This is actually a clip in Dragon Smash. Ooh. Top 10 PK Thunders where he does that. And that was That's the guy. Yeah, that was Corey. That's him? Yeah, oh. that's Corey. That's, maybe that's where you see the tag. Yeah, yeah. Cause yeah, that clip where he like uh, hits the up beam under battlefield and, and I like hits goes the villager off. with the bat. Yeah. yeah. That's this guy. That's this guy, guys. He's famous. <laughs> He's kind of a big deal, guys. <laughs> Make sure you get his autograph before he leaves. <laughs> so unfortunately for Zep Dragon, he's kind of, kind of trailing behind now. Ooh. That was a good favorite grab. Yeah. Uh, uh, Corio's only one back throw away. All right, maybe two back throws away. But that was it's nice. looking pretty difficult for Zep Dragon to bring this back. Corio seems that the switch seems to have greatly benefited him. Yeah, Zep, Zep Dragon um, unfortunately took a pretty Ooh. oh that was the, took a pretty unfortunate nosedive earlier, and all that rage he had when he died, he was only like 110, so he was still like safely in the not dead zone, um, mm -hmm. and he lost the rage he could have used to. Now Bowser's either gonna kill really early or get killed by one single back throw. I I believe if uh, if Bowser gets two grabs, he might just have to skip. Good Zep Dragon. I know he loves to use Bowser's jabs because they're really safe. Oh, yeah, Bowser's jab is really good. I think it does, it does a good amount of damage. Five percent damage for the first oh. hit. Oh wow, that was that was a good back throw. I uh, was able to get the game two. So Corio's up. Uh, so the nest switch looked like it was a good idea. Yeah. Um,
What was I gonna say? I forget. I I wonder. Uh, I mean, I was, I'm gonna be honest. That was pretty pretty uh, convincing from uh, Corio. So I'm kind of wondering, uh, is that is that Dragon willing to stay Bowser and kind of go for a different, a better stage pick, or is he just gonna? Uh, he plays Charizard there? and Roy too, right? Uh, yes, he does. I I, I wouldn't know how uh, either of those, both of those, are kind of low tier. Uh, Ness being one of the better characters in the game, uh, I I just don't know how they would do. Oh, uh, he's gonna pull the Charizard. Gonna go to Charizard. And gonna go duck. Oh, all right. So the duck, the duck hunt pick with Charizard, uh, very smart. Uh, duck hunt is definitely one of Charizard's best stages. Because of the z-axis. Uh, well, that's one of the one of the few reasons. Okay, uh, if, if that's all you were gonna say, I would have been really upset. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, well, so so uh, if you didn't know, uh, this on this stage, uh, I'm just gonna explain what the z-axis yeah. is. On this stage, the characters are actually flat. So, so the like uh, Z axis or like the in and then out, so you know, uh, closer to the screen, farther away from the screen, uh, that's gone. So when you, so when Charizard uses uh, some of his moves, they uh, they just kind of appear straight there, and they don't have they automatically hit their sweet spot. Specifically uh, back air. Yeah, back air and uh, side tilt too. It also makes Ness's air dodge worse. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, but one of the, but the actually, I want to say probably the biggest reason is, uh, is actually the tree. Uh, Charizard, that's a great back air. Uh, but Charizard is ha uh, having one of the, uh, I, I want to say, top three best kill throws in the game, up throw. Uh, so that tree is very, very good at uh, making that kill throw uh, way better. Because, like, if you, if you grab him where that tree is, like, right now, uh, you up throw, yeah. Because all the way at the top, I mean, it's really strong. I'd like to point out that in all the time I spent with Corio, he said that he would Ooh. never play on this stage. So there's no reason to ever practice on it. Really? Yet here he is. Says <laughs> <laughs> so he fans it every time, but here he is. Hope he comes oh. back and watches it. I wonder uh, wonder what prompted the ban of other stages. Not yeah. Or not, uh, not talking about. Yep, see, and that's Ooh, it. Ooh, that's it. Okay, so Zep has got a quite a hill to climb. Yeah, uh, Ooh, nice. Charizard does a lot of damage, but uh, again, Ness always ready with that back throw, and Corio really looking like he's uh, he's ready to just to throw it out when he gets when he gets the grab. Charizard surprisingly fast on the ground, easily able to chase Ness down in a tech chase situation. Yeah, we'll we'll see. Maybe um, I don't know. Maybe maybe, maybe this race is gonna be beneficial. Dragon hanging under that tree. Corio recognizing that he, he wants to be under that tree. Yeah, Char Charizard can't afford to get back uh -huh. there. Um, can't afford to get back here. Can't afford to get up air. No, he's a huge hitbox. Ooh. Oh, that's it. Corio advances. Corio advances first seed in this pool. Congratulations to Corio.